What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel. We're online at www.whatsupinthesky.com and you are looking at, this is still around Dingo Gap. This is from my, uh, I've got so many subscribers that send me stuff and uh, one of my favorites, we've got this guy, he's a doctor from California, his name is William. He sends me some really good stuff and uh, he's also got some engineering degrees. The guy's a genius, he's got so many degrees, it's, it's uh, ridiculous. And one of them was engineering as well as uh, you know his doctors and stuff like that. But what I wanted to show you here is, and uh, once thanks again, you guys, for all the condolences for my father. I needed to take a break to get uh, from all that stuff to come in here and do something a little bit normal, what I used to do. So I'm excited about this one. This is just kind of cool. Uh, this won't be a too long video, but what we've got here, he said right off the bat, he was like, Will, check this out. This is absolutely what looks like the uh, the 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 base of a building, you know, the the uh, structure, not the structure, what am I trying to say? Man, my mind has been just everywhere lately. The uh, foundation from a building, it comes in at 90 degrees and even has like a little uh, a little bulge there and it comes right back down. It just looks like it's been, uh, and it comes here and it comes back and it comes through and it just looks like it's been buried by all the rocks. Now also in here, it looks like he noticed what could be some sort of, uh, it looks like the top of a statue, um, some sort of effigy. Out here, you've got some little perfect triangles. It looks like tops of pyramids or things like that. And who knows how far this stuff goes down. Right now, we're really getting into some interesting stuff. Um, all, the, all the Mars guys are out there hitting them up right now. There's so much good stuff out there. Look down in here. There's like a perfect circle plate or something that's fallen off. Up here seems to have, uh, you know, looks like perfect circle type things. Let's see what we can do here. Let me show you where to get it, and always, all you got to do is check the description below. It'll be in there. Um, you can get to this link, and here you get the full resolution. Hit, you just click it right there. You save it to your hard drive, however you want to do it. And then I've got it up in Photoshop, which you can see it's the same picture here. I want to do first, I'm going to image. I'm going to hit this auto color, just to kind of make it look like it's more on our planet. Now, a lot of the, late, the new mass cam images are coming with this right here. I'm not sure what exactly is going on. Um, if that's going to be something that's permanent in the pictures from now, but uh, I've noticed that, so I don't think that's an anomaly. I've noticed that throughout the thing. And uh, let's go ahead and look out here in the distance. It's kind of uh, out here. There's not much, you know. It's kind of just uh, looks like somebody's backyard, to be honest with you. <laughs> looks like there's not much there at all. Uh, but then as you get closer, this here does seem to be like almost like a perfect little triangle. It's kind of hard to when you're at this resolution actually say it's perfect but you know in my head it looks perfect to me and then when I come up let's take a look at some of this stuff you're gonna see all sorts of stuff in here just this definitely looks to be some sort of carved see how it's got these marks in here it's almost whether it's the top of a statue or something I don't know but it seems like all these types fit together and see how it's hard to see here but there's there's grooving in it like right here has got a grooving in it this way let me get the little pointer and uh, a groove going that way. Over here, you've got what seems to be these, um, what looks like the end of machinery at some time. Something that, you know, if you follow our, my channel, most likely if you're watching this, you've seen some of my videos before. I think the Mars was uh, basically exploded at some time. Something happened on that planet. And it looks like right here, there's a, uh, see this line running through here? How conveniently it's like the, which it's weird because it almost looks like an artifact in the picture or like possibly like a sun flare or something. But look at the uh, symmetry here. Look at this thing here. It's like got a perfect triangle, or not perfect triangle, perfect uh, rectangle here, a little circle in it. Here look like a perfect circle with some things coming out of it, almost like a gear type thing. I know it's a little fuzzy. It's hard to see. That's one thing about these new pictures. Like I said, billions of dollars we spent on this machine, and this is the stuff we get back. Where you can take your cell phone outside from four years ago and get better pictures than this. I mean, we're right up on this stuff. And uh, it does. This definitely looks like it's a billion. And you look, it almost looks as if it's 90 degrees here, too. Like you can almost follow it back. Um, let's check this out here in the corner here. I'm going to go down in here and take a good look at this. See that seems to be some sort of plate that's buried in there under it, like it's kind of falling off the side or something along those lines. And if uh, 
you know, I'm not sure exactly how old this stuff would be, because I'm talking a, a very old civilization up there. And since whatever happened to it happened, you know, the uh, whether there's a cataclysm, floods and all that stuff, everything was thrown about the planet. Um, everything was buried under just sand. All the sandstorms come ripping through, um, buries it and buries it. Let's see what we've got here. Is this coming up here? It's kind of interesting, too, just uh, the markings on it and things like that. This one as well. I don't know if that caught your eye, but it looks like it caught my eye a little bit. Um, but he definitely said, William, he was he's the doctor, Dr. D. He was like, this is definitely something, like some sort of building or something here that uh, that was there at one time, or at least was used for it. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know below, as always. I'm going to, like I said, in the description box. Let's see if we can't play around with the picture a little bit with the adjustments, see what we can get. There's so many good ones he sent too. This is just one of them. I mean, there's, I think 50 he just sent. Um, these new pictures, as we roll up through this, they're just getting better and better. But they're getting, <laughs> but the quality of them is getting worse and worse. So I really hope that they don't fail the rover lately. I've been thinking in my head for some reason, I'm thinking as we get closer, the stuff's going to be harder to find or harder to hide. Uh, as we get closer to the mountain, uh, there's probably going to be more more junk that's been pushed up against it, especially if there was water here at one time. I'd imagine a lot of it's collected towards the mountain and pushed into it. But let me run through the gamut and see if you guys... Anything else that you guys notice in here? Let me know below if you see anything else I missed. Um, once again, thank you guys for the condolences from my father. It's been you know just outpouring from you guys. I, I don't even know what to say other than thank you guys. I love you guys. And I hope you enjoy... This little thing right here, too, is kind of interesting. Not exactly sure what that is, but taking a gander at this, this definitely looks like it had been cut from something, or it definitely looks like the top of a head. <laughs> I mean, it really does. Like, this would be the nose and the eyes, and it's just, you know, buried up to its, you know, nose and ears and forehead. So, much love, guys. It's your buddy Will from What's Up in the Sky 37. As always, www.whatsupinthesky.com. Check out there. I got a bunch more videos going to be coming to you. This service my father is a Saturday. Hopefully next week I'll be getting into the swing of things again. Um, feeling a little bit more myself. So much love. Take it easy. Peace.